any of the Halloween movies. I love bad movies. I love bad scary movies. I love bad romances. I love any bad movie and I love any bad TV shows. There's just so many cliches and Michael Myers never dies, ever. You could try and kill him so many ways. You could bomb him and he just won't die. And I'm like, that's so stupid. I love it. I love how dumb it is. I have to say the Five Nights at Freddy's, I know it hasn't come out yet, but I'm very excited to see it. It seems scary and seems pop up. Uh, for me, Quiet Place is my favorite movie, mainly because how different it is compared to other movies. It's, it was very a fun experience, considering uh, there's a lot of suspense, uh, considering it's a very quiet movie compared to the most jump scares and everything. For me, yeah, it was really intense. I really loved the movie. It's more of a Halloween movie, but uh, The Nightmare Before Christmas, uh, I used to watch it with my family. Uh, every night on October 1st, so it's just a bit of a tradition for me and it's a uh, very comfortable movie to watch. Paranormal activity. I think that like one scene where the like the drawers and stuff open when she's alone in her kitchen, I think like I've always had kind of a fear of being alone at home and something like that happening, so I would say that, yeah. <laughs> Coraline. I think it's really nostalgic. I really like the art style of it. Something about stop motion, it just feels so like personal. The Conjuring. I like the jump scares in it. 